thousands of public school teachers in Chicago, the nation's third largest school district, are on strike. The teachers' message is the same, and their resolve has not diminished. We have a strong union, we have a lot of solidarity, and I trust Karen Lewis and the union to do the right thing by us. In fact, it's, it's hard to stand out here at some point and think about the fact that my students are falling behind, that they're sitting at home. This isn't where I want to be, this is just where I have to be in order to be an advocate for them in the long run. NEA and its affiliates are such effective advocates. It is not because of our creative ideas. People are impressed. Let me tell you, I spent those years smoking lots of weed, self-medicating. It is not because of the merit of our positions. This is sort of like an Arab Spring here in Chicago right now. It is not because we care about children. It might be weird. Isn't the same way that, like, you know, the Civil War was fought? Yes, a lot of people died, but it stopped slavery. You see what I'm saying? And it is not because we have a vision of a great public school for every child. Why shouldn't that person, those parents, have the same options to be able to get the kid out of a failing school and into a, yeah. one that works? Some, some of these well, uh, parents you know, can't afford to take uh, the kids out of a school. Life's not always fair, and I'm sorry about that. The life's not always fair, and I'm sorry about that. NEA and its affiliates are effective advocates because we have power. Oh, God, I'm sorry, there are kids here. I wasn't supposed to say that, right? <laughs> Too late.